Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Daniel Rosal here. Um, I'm going to do a video today regarding Amazon's free shipping to Israel deal. You'll hear it talked about a lot if you're an immigrant to Israel. Um, you'll talk, you'll hear about the VAT law, talked about how much you can buy before you have to pay VAT of 17%. It's really not that complicated, but um, I'm going to make a video nonetheless to show you how you can sort of maximize this deal. Now, Amazon doesn't ship a lot of stuff to Israel in the broad scheme of things, but it does ship a decent amount of products, right? So not everything will ship, but um, certain things will ship. And they've had this deal for ages now. You see on my, in the center of the screen, free shipping to Israel and qualifying orders over 49 bucks. Asterix restrictions apply. So I'm gonna explain what those restrictions are basically. So here's the deal. Um, Amazon have qualifying items in this free shipping to Israel deal. So you know what, let me just uh, search for uh, audio mixer, okay? And we're gonna get some products. Now there's a difference between ships to Israel, you see here ships to Israel, and free shipping to Israel. So for Amazon, the traditional problem of buying stuff to Israel has been that the shipping has been really expensive and a lot more, sometimes like more than the value of the item. So to incentivize people to actually buy from Amazon, they introduced a free shipping deal in which the shipping is free. Now that doesn't mean that, just because the shipping's free doesn't mean that it's going to be VAT free. So let's start by getting, by listing here what is eligible for free shipping. Top left hand corner, firstly make sure your address is set to your Israeli address. If you have a foreign address in the account, you can see in the top left I have delivered to Daniel Jerusalem. Free shipping by Amazon. So I'm gonna go ahead now and tick this on and one to 49 of over 2000 results versus over 4,000 results. So we just excluded 2000 products like half the audio mixers because they weren't included in the free shipping deal. Now, we're, you can order stuff that's over the VAT free limit. Just to clarify what that means, the VAT free limit is you can order stuff up to $75 goods value VAT free okay the shipping so long as the shipping is itemized separately you can order stuff might be $75 shipping and fifth sorry $75 for let's say your audio mixer $15 for shipping so your bill is 90 but you should still get that for uh, sorry bad example because 75 is 75 and over let's say your audio mixer was $74 right just under the limit but $15 shipping, you should still only that you should still have no VAT to pay on that audio mixer. By contrary, if you order, let's say, this Yamaha mixer, it's 140 bucks. So the shipping is going to be free, but you can see here $41 for your import fee deposit. So, in other words, because so the, the good thing about ordering from Amazon is that they calculate the Israeli taxes. So we have a, a situation here in which we're getting free shipping but we're still gonna have to pay $40 on top of the good value in order to get it here to Israel. Now let's say for whatever reason you were intent on not paying anything more. So what you would do here is there's a min and max operator here on the left. And what I would do is specify the maximum value as $74. I wouldn't even do $74.99 just in case they round up. So I'm gonna do 74 as my uh maximum and your minimum you could you could either put together a few small low value items or you could set the floor to 49 dollars per the terms of the offer so this is really the kind of uh i wouldn't say hack but this is a way to really squeeze out the best uh value from this deal so i'm going to click on go now and now we only have 291 results right so the reason i i actually do use this filter is because you know, the, the value in Amazon is our customer service is great, the stuff arrives quickly, so I may as, you may as well get halfway decent goods for that hassle, right? By the way, Israel will aggregate successive orders made within a 72 hour window. So if, you're, or if you are ordering multiple Amazon items, my advice would be to order them one week apart so the tax people don't aggregate them. I know you're thinking this guy is a complete, uh, scamming the system but look what can i say it's tough to live here so here's a great item i would totally buy in fact i'm resisting the urge to buy this thing currently because i have a audio interface but this one has 
is a you is a USB interface and you've also got some EQ effects on it, right? Now this is to to my mind a great thing to order to Israel from Amazon. Why? Because it's sixty nine dollars, so it's just under the tax free cutoff. It's free delivery to Israel. So if I were to order this now, I would only pay sixty nine dollars. So I'm effectively getting free shipping and getting a product that is you know worth a little bit, and it's going to come to my door in Israel for no additional costs on this. So I hope that explains how it works, what the deal is, um, what might, what is kind of worth buying. Just make sure you have your delivery address configured correctly in Amazon because I've heard of people in different parts of Israel getting, you know, some stuff will ship to Jerusalem but not to somewhere, you know, out in the sticks. So uh, you just have to make sure that you've got that set up correctly. Hope this video is useful if you are looking to buy stuff to Amazon for Israel but you're not quite sure about all this talk about free shipping and VAT and $75 means. If you do want to get more videos from me about living in Israel, for the moment, follow the Living in Israel playlist. I'll pop a link in the description. And thank you for watching this video.